This is your CBS 46 News update. Good Tuesday afternoon. I'm Karen Greer. A heartbreaking update to a CBS 46 exclusive. We've learned a 17 year old Maris school student died from meningitis. Helen Whammy started feeling ill last Wednesday and died within a day. Helen was an honor student at Marist and dreamed of becoming a doctor. She was also a star on stage as an experienced dancer. New details now to a story we've been following for a few days. Clayton County Police finding a man's body on the side of a road close to where they found a woman's body hours earlier. Crews found the man just after eight Sunday night near Roy Huey and Westbury Roads. Investigators say he was shot multiple times. Then earlier Sunday morning on the same day, they found 30 year old Cormelia Thomas, who was also shot several times and dumped near I-675. Police are investigating to see if these incidents could be related. All right, let's get the latest on our weather because we know that's what you care about. Meteorologist Ella Dorsey tracking that rain. She says it's going to be like a month's worth of rain. A month's worth of rain, Karen, just in the next few days. OK, so you definitely are going to want to plan on giving yourself extra time on the roadways, not only today, not only tomorrow, but Thursday as well. Let me show you the rainfall totals. We've already picked up an inch to two inches of rain and we're going to get an additional what? two to possibly even three inches. So that is a total of six to seven inches. That's double what we're supposed to see the entire month of October. So we are under a flash flood watch through 2 a.m. on Thursday. We are seeing some flash flooding across Metro. You're going to want to keep the umbrella handy. We're going to see rounds of heavy rain through Thursday. We will start to dry out Friday and the weekend looks really nice. This has been your personal news update from CBS 46 News.